academy and recruitment. They are two of Bristol City's five key pillars and also the reason behind Brian Tinian's return to the club. After more than eight years away, the chance to rejoin the club as the new director of youth recruitment was too good to turn down. And this week, he took the opportunity to invite several youngsters released by academies of other Premier and Football League clubs to the Phelan training complex for a practice match. These are people who's, uh, who have come to us uh, through agents and um, actually emailing and sending letters themselves as players. So um, it's great to give them an opportunity, you know, because they're not good enough for Newcastle or Tottenham or West Ham doesn't mean they're not good enough for us. You know, it's happened in the past where people have released clubs and not quite got it right and hopefully we'll find one today. In his new post since June 1st, Tinian says he's thoroughly enjoying the challenges of the role. Great to be back in Bristol, find, trying to find uh, the young players in Bristol first, you know, from 7, 8, 9, 10, all the way up. And now this is just a little bit extra to get these people in who've been actually in the professional game, but have had a bit of a knockback and now given the opportunity to, uh, to come back and fight again. I'm delighted with Brian's appointment. I think he's you know, credible, uh, not only as a player, but also as a manager. Um, and he's just got great gravitas. You know, If you've got a young player that's looking to, to become you know, the, the next Brian Tinian, then who better to speak to is, is Brian Tinian. So you know, we're delighted to have him on board. Uh, and I'm really you know, uh, optimistic and excited about what this next season brings. The club has recognised the need to increase the number of homegrown players coming through its academy and securing a first-team place. In recent years, only Cole Scoos has regularly nailed down a starting role, but now with the emergence of Joe Bryan, Bobby Reid and Wes Burns, Tinian hopes it's the start of better things to come. We want to recruit as good as we can. You know, if you recruit good players, then um, the likely it is they're going to get the opportunity at first-team level. And that's all we can do. We can try and make it so we, uh, we make, create and help develop players that are knocking on the door on the first team. And then obviously the manager, if he thinks they're good enough, will play them. It's hugely important because we're obviously in a results driven industry and we want to make sure that we're always playing at the highest possible level. And you can only do that if you recruit the right talent. Clearly we've got you know, a great academy that is used to developing players. Uh, so talent development is key. But you have to have the raw ingredients in order to make sure that you know, we have players that are ready for Bristol City's first team.